One, two, three. Hey everybody, uh, welcome back, more for XP here. Uh, back with some more Pokemon Stadium. I uh, didn't want to wait for people to do multiplayer shit. Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and join the stadium, and we're gonna try our hand at the Prime Cup today. Now, I may have um, a face cam with this. I'm not certain if it's gonna work out or not. I like, I don't know why, I'm just like, figured I'll test the face cam thing and see how it goes. Um, so Pokeball was like lowest difficulty. I'm not really sure what the difference is between Pokeball, Ultra Ball, Great Ball, and fucking Master Ball. I was thinking it was difficulty. So, this could be like super easy. But we're gonna go with the, the, Pokeball. Um, and I've been working on beating the uh, Elite Four slash Rival with various different teams. Um, I managed to do it with a Caterpie the other day. That was interesting. But I'm gonna try and get every Pokemon to like have been used for something. To beat the Elite Four. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna get all the Pokemon in my victory trophy room thing, I think. Whatever. Just to say I did it, you know. Just a little fun challenge for myself. Um, I figured that'd be kind of boring, though, since I already beat the Elite Four in them. So, that's, that's, yeah, Starmie is my number one choice for this, I guess. Because the, the team that I use for the, um, yeah, the team I use to do that with is usually three random Pokemon, and then Starmie, Jinx, and, um, uh, fuck, Raichu. And the, the, their movesets are basically the same for this as it is that you use there. Um, so that may be good, that may not be good. I'm not really sure who I want to use for my other three, though. Because I'm not too keen on the moveset of these three. I might use Ivysaur. Because he has Razor Leaf as opposed to Solar Beam, and he has Mega Drain. Um, I know Blastoise looks pretty good. Yeah, I used a Caterpie and a Metapod. No, I didn't use a Metapod, I just used a Caterpie when I did it earlier. But. That was kind of funny. Genome strength. I know Primate was was one that I had considered using. I tested him him out a little bit. I might go with him. I'll probably have Alakazam in the mix as well. I'm gonna go ahead and throw Alakazam in. Primate. Um, how's Exeggutor look in the Sleep Powder Psychic Soul Stop? Uh, yeah, maybe. Damn, yes, that is like a moveset that I want. Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, Ice Punch. Hitmonchan. I might use him instead of Primate for that variation there. Um, I 
Mole Trace, maybe, for Fire Blast. What do I have? I have Water, Ice Psychic, Electric, another Psychic, a Fighting. Yeah, I guess Mole Trace is good. Alright, let's see what happens. Look at this scrub team. Alright, um... Guess I'll take Mole Trace, Starmie, and let's go with, uh... Put Monchan, sure, why not? Finally underway. Pokemon Honestly, Starmie could probably sweep this team. Because the strategy for beating Elite Four with is like Starmie will sweep the rock fighting team. Um Jinx will sweep the ghost poison team. Who else? Building energy do you think? for the next attack. Yeah, Raichu is really good against Lorelei, but I don't think he can sweep it. And then Lance, obviously Raichu and Jinx are pretty good against. But it's like those three are pretty much like the key components to beating like the Elite Four. Like you can pretty much do it with the, just just the three of them by themselves. Sky attack. What now? There, it's a hit. What a furious battle! Sorry, we'll connect some 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 fucking computer shit. And make sure my recording is good. Yeah, fucking Moltres can sweep this team. I need to stop saying God. I know I swear too much. I swear way too much. I'm trying to get good and not be a scrub. Um, now Christian, the guy who actually like had this before me, had the Mewtwo unlocked, so I have that in my registration team. So if I wanted to, I could use one of the registered teams and have Mewtwo. I might do that if, if like, this gets too hard with the team that I have. Because I think the registered teams vary, but I think the number one was, like... Charizard... Blastoise, Venusaur, Zapdos, Articuno, Mol uh, fuck, um, Mewtwo, I think. I gotta continue for that. This rocket scrub. Poison and some water. <laughs> Alright. Go Jinx Raichu Hitmonchan. What kind of battle can we expect to see? Begin round two. Let's see here. What do we want to do? Let's hit him with a psychic for starters. Fucking people need to stop texting me, sorry. It distracts me and... There's been major action already! 
Maybe I should like turn this little bit and put some spike. There. The remaining Pokemon count is three to two. So that only seems half of my face into like more of the front. Um Ice Punch. They go into battle poses. What now? Yeah, it's a hit! Damn, dude, his nose is long. What's this? Holy oh, shit, that stretched real far there. The yeah, I also, last recording, I completely forgot to sync when I uploaded it to YouTube. So you may notice, like, a three-second delay on me. That's not my reflexes being shit. That's me forgetting to fucking sync my audio. So it's, like, slow by, like, a few seconds. What's that? Neither one is conceding at eight. Just body slam. What now? I'm also hit. drinking stuff. Mmm, drinking. What's this? Not alcohol. No, not alcohol. What a just, battle. just pop. Which is the right term. It's not soda, it's pop. Because soda is when you combine it with ice cream. That was the original definition. There's a distinct difference in the number of remaining Pokemon. Look fucking light more in here. So. The remaining Pokemon count is. Why is he like green? Looks green. Psychic, I think, might be super effective. Yes, I would like to keep battling, and I got another continue because I fucking perfected that one. Fighting! Right? No! Yes! A little bit of fighting. A little bit of fighting. Mm. Let's go with Alakazam. Um... Jinx and Hitmonchan, sure. Because I'm just thinking that Pikachu is going to be the one that kind of counters here. Cubone may be a little bit, but not as much. Psybeam! Also, um, the reason why I use, like, Alakazam and, like, Raichu... Because I, I usually use Vaporeon, or not Vaporeon, Jolteon. Um, that was the team, or that was the electric type that I used to beat the Elite Four the first time. But Raichu, I believe, is faster, and, and is a little bit more balanced towards his special, which he has Thunder, so... Like, because Jolteon was kind of hat like... He had some physical moves. He wasn't entirely just special, like, straight electric like Raichu is. Um, so I think Raichu being slightly faster and actually having more... Um, special to do damage with, yeah. It was technically a better choice, and for some reason, I feel like he hits with Thunder more than um, Jolteon does. What this? Fucking cat. Luna, a big in you bugging out now? Yeah, she like jumped up here and like fucked up my recording setup, so I yelled at her earlier. Oh, he is 
Down and out. No problem, no There's problem. I got that. Alakazam might sweep this one for me, get me another perfect. Oh yeah, this is done. The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. The battle has become Um Yeah, but Alakazam's one of the fastest, like psychics. Um Raichu's like the fastest electric. I think Electabuzz is faster. But um Raichu has like a higher special again. Like it's not as physical focused as some of the other electric types, like they're slightly balanced towards it. Nice. Um and then Jinx because Psychic Ice. And she's actually kinda fast as well. Like, she's not as fast as Alakazam or Raichu, but that psychic like ice combo and putting people to sleep is pretty effective. So Stormy's gonna start this one out. Stormy's gonna sweep this, bro. Stormy is gonna fucking sweep this. Guaranteed. There's no way he's gonna fucking sweep this whole thing. Watch. I guarantee it. Ready? Bubble beam. Bubble beam it out, bro. Yep. It's not one hit. Yep, crits as well, so that's one down. No problem. This'll be like unless he throws out the Nidorina. What was it a Nidorina A or Nidorina O? Unless he throws out that one, then this is pretty much gonna be like one hit everything pretty much. Also, Stormy seems to hit with Thunder more than the Jolteon does. Like, overall. Because there were times where, like, I was like, Jolteon, you have to hit this, and it would miss everything. Although I have seen some really bullshit fights where, like, Raichu missed, I think it was three Thunders in a row, and the enemy crit three times in a row. Like, it was just, no. A distinct difference in the number of remaining Pokemon. So, oh, the litter and mail. The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. Literally, no, yeah. The battle has become one side. Um, Bubble Beam, I guess. Just because I don't want the Thunder to miss. Let me get stabbed with Bubble Beam. Same type attack bonus. Stab, for those of you who don't know what a stab is. It means if you use the same, like, a, a move of the same type as the Pokemon, it gets a, like, a point, like, 1.5 damage. So if you stab and it's a crit, it's like 2.5 damage. So. Glad that missed. Not glad that I'm paralyzed. Come on, Stormy, you can fucking sweep this. Thank you. Damn it. I promised a Stormy sweep, now deliver. There we go, finally! Damn, dude, that was nuts! Three fucking rounds in a row where nothing happened. Alright, halfway through. I got another, uh... Perfect off that Stormy sweep. So. Looking at grass water. 